Can you make a monitor here, please? Because there's no monitor. Okay. Because I will a clicker. Because I will talk about the blockchain and media. Okay. Okay. Blockchain and media. So the question is if it will be transformation or it will be metamorphosis. Of course, it will be metamorphosis because of the technology called blockchain. Um, all of you understand what is a blockchain is? Who don't understand? Oh, oh, few. Oh. So, you don't need to understand how the blockchain is work. You're not a coder. You don't need to understand how this is uh, the, the airlines, how the um, airplane fly. This is hundred tons of uh, metal. But you need to know the benefits of this. So we just will talk about the benefits, benefits of blockchain. So blockchain start to disrupt financial system, cryptocurrencies, so-called. But it's originally it came from the media. If you know what is mean, Torrens, Kaza, Yidonki, and everything, and it start come from the Bitcoin, go to the smart contract, they came now to the Internet of Things, industrial and Internet of Things, and we facing now with the energy of things, decentralized energy, then we go to the economy of things, and then the wisdom economy, which we will try to come with a such technology of blockchain, but we will talk about the media. So we have a cycle in media, and you have a now we are cycle number four. So we are here. So we are here when we need a lot of new, new heroes because the existing, existing ecosystem system not so good for creators. And creators, they create all this content which you love. And they are frustrating for them with Netflix, with YouTube, because it's a middle part and the third part. So blockchain will disrupt the existing ecosystem and will bring directly creators to the customers, to the viewers. So no third party. So who will win if it will be disrupted? The wins, the major will will be creators, studios, influencers, consumers, but of course audience. Audience will win a lot from this. And not only win, but they also can have a benefits from this. So if you can see this anti granddad's current Indle, and then we now see the morning stars already. They very big. So so what will be blockchain in the media in the in entertainment, blockchain for media and entertainment. A metadata, smart contract, global decentralized database, hashes, financial, new, new way of funding, and smart contracts, nano payments. A new format will come with holograms and mixed reality. It will be transparency, real time feedback, and data mining and smart media and trading with data. So, what is smart contracts? For example, it's already existing a boat who can make a contract for film industry. Sometimes you need 500 actors, 1,000 actors to not leading role, but 1,000 actors. And jury, uh, lawyer, he tried to make 1,000 contracts. It's, but now the boat can make it for one minute and then have put to the blockchain and cut a lot of costs from media industry. What can be blockchain for creators. So now creators have a major part of self-cost. It was not like a production, like if you remember the DVD, you need to print DVD, bring DVD, storage DVD, distribution, retail. It's for creators have a small part. But now creators, creators have a major part of, of, of the self-cost of the product. So, but creators don't know their viewers. They do not have access to the data. So cinema, a chain of the cinema, centralized, and they don't give to the creators no data about the viewers. So 
cinema and platforms also centralize and they don't share a revenue, a fair revenue with the creators. And so all is centralized. Everything is centralized. And streaming, which now growing and live streaming, only two companies trying to make a data for the creators. I don't know if you're familiar with these companies. So now, if you investor know what means QIC, know your client for the bank and financial, now the creators can know your spectaculars. So QIS. So blockchain with and data. So one case with the dot blockchain media. So how it will come now? Remember internet? They came with a new format. Let's say for music it was MP3. For uh, video, it was MPEG, for, for JPEG, and all other new formats. We need the new formats for blockchain. Because if you just put MP3 in the <laughs> blockchain, it will be not blockchain. So uh, the new fo format now has arrived. It's called .bc. So which means, let's say, just example, this is a capsule. So. In this capsule will be a new file, let's say Adele. They come with a new song, she come with a new song. And before digital, and this media entertainment business was term, very important term called master tape or master. It was only one single master and then it was limited copies for this. And digital internet age was bring a new innovation and the term of master tape was disappear because you can have a, the same quality, unlimited, unlimited copies of your masters. So the value of master disappear and term of master disappear, but blockchain will bring the master back. So it will be only one copy of the song of Adele and it will be covering by smart contracts. And this is a capsule, will not distribute. Instead of distribution, Adele will make access to this capsule. So 300 millions, you don't need to send 300 million copies. You don't need to do it. You just give access for the people. And 300 million people come to listen to this song, to this uh, capsule. And Smart contract will manage to whom, which territory, which age, what kind of quality, if they will higher quality, maybe payment, maybe the simple quality, maybe free. So the smart contract will manage everything inside this capsule. But what's more important is that they will know directly their listeners, the audience, and have all data of this audience. This is very, very important things. So can you imagine, let's say, next uh, Avatar film? If they will have w one billion viewers in this one capsule, they know it. And they, for the next film, Avatar, if they ask their audience to just make a crowdfunding, and everyone will give just one dollar or 50 cents, it will be more than enough to have 10 series of Avatar. Next Games of Thrones will be funded easily. So this new .bc format now make a proof from three copyright society, global, European, American, and Asian, from big publisher like a Warner Chapel, a major, and big major as a Warner Music, we need now. And now we're waiting for Universal who will prove this new format. So it will be new format for industry. So we don't need to understand how it works, but we need to understand the benefit of this. So now another benefit of blockchain, it's a data mining. So data mining growing as a help. So data, now it's a, it's a next brain for our society. You can see this is social world we are with our agent and computer and technical world. There is a smart city, smart transportation, smart energy. So all this technical world will need 
a fuel. They will need a data. And who can bring this data to this technical world for our <laughs> best future? We are. We will produce this data. But in the middle will be data mining. So this is a nice picture of the future city. This is how can raise huge rising of um, data just to automotive part here. So why we need the data? Because data will become information, information will become knowledge, and knowledge will become a wisdom to make wise decision. What is a wise decision? Wise decision instead of analytic this decision which we have now. It's predictable. And we need predictable future, predictable analytic, predictable future. So what is the data? How it's come with entertainment and media? You see this Cristiano Ronaldo, he has 300 million followers. So he now 10 times larger than biggest uh, TV channel in, in the world. Three, 10 times bigger than HBO. So he has 300 million viewers, so he is a media. He is a I'm media instead of corporate vertical media. So he can bring a lot of data and data will looks like a mountains. So if you will see the data slides, so, so data slides, it looks like a mountain. So this landscape of the future. So all these automotive drones, smart cities, they will need the data. <coughs> and this data will come from the media and entertainment. Because 85% of all social post talk, what we are talking about. We're talking about new films, new music, uh, about some uh, stories, about, about celebrity, about entertainment, about the media. So entertain, entertainment was before supported by big infrastructure projects from bank, insurance company, automotive, but now media entertainment will be supported by, oh, now infrastructure and the big companies will be supported by media and entertainment because of the data, of the data and because of data mining, data processing. So the future will need a lot of data because humans is unpredictable all the smart cities or drones, automotive cars, they are programming, but the humans is unpredictable. And we need to understand how behavior of the humans, and especially when it's come anomalies and some specific, specific situation. So that's why we need this so much data to bring from data information, knowledge to our predictable decision. So the next benefits from um, blockchain will be iOS. What is iOS? You know what means Internet of Things, when there's a billion of devices connected with, with each other, interconnected. So it will be Internet of Content, so IOC. So Internet of Content, which, which help us to have adaptive media, so we can be in adaptive media and during the stream can make a mix of the music with the tempo you like, with the sound you like. Maybe Mark likes the song more acoustic and I love more drums. So we both have, will have a different a mix, real time, a different mix. Or we can change maybe a characters of the next Games of Thrones for the person which we like. So this is will be adaptive media because the pieces of the every single track or stamps or episode, we can mix it online by streaming. So that's what benefits of blockchain. I can explain once again. So this is will be a fun funding, crowdfunding easily, nano payment, which cause I can just want to listen one chorus of these songs. I don't need any songs. I don't need to be subscription and Spotify and pay $10 or $5 per 
per month. I can pay just 0.05 cents if I need one chorus in my month. So I don't need it. So co-creation, it will be real-time co-creation with blockchain, adaptive media, hologram, and mixed reality. So it's not virtual reality, not augmented reality, mixed reality will come to our to our life. So it's then monetization of data. So blockchain will help media and entertainment to keep piracy and stol stolen ideas, uh, crowdfunding, micro lending and factoring, micro and nano payments, access instead of distribution, crowdsourcing and data, data, data. And blockchain and media will help to the smart cities Internet of Things, automotive and driverless car, drones, industrial Internet of Things, energy of things and decentralized energy. But we need a lot of the power because consumption of power is a huge. So um, there is some solution with good mining operation for the yacht data. Uh, so we come to the age of mountains of data and we will be a gold because we are data thank you so much